Knife defense uh, side thrust here. This is when somebody uh, comes in and they're stabbing here. It's like the baseball bat swing of knife, knife stabs. I don't know. I don't really know uh, who would stab like this. The only thing I can think here is if someone's kind of holding on to me and they're trying to stab in like this. So if we end up in this, um, this thumb down grab, right? Uh, where we would normally just do like a, a shoulder lock or a, sorry, an arm lock right there. Um, we no longer can anymore because he has a knife. So just like our uh, backhand, we're gonna do our little field goal here. We're gonna protect and frame right here against the body, protecting our vital organs here. So as he tries to stab in, we're gonna block here on the wrist and on the forearm right here, and I'm immediately gonna catch so that he can't draw back to stab again, okay? So as soon as we're in this position, hands are up, boom. I've caught so that he can't re-stab. Keeping this one, okay, I'm just five fingers. On the wrist here, this one's gonna come under and grab his hand and the butt of the knife. From here, I'm gonna lever using the side of my wrist. Again, you're gonna get cut. <clears throat> I don't know uh, how <laughs> instinctual it's gonna to be to continue to press on this when we're getting cut. <clears throat> my guess is that uh, you're gonna to wanna to withdraw rather than continue to press through. But pressing ideally down here on the handle, if any of it is exposed. Okay, there's a little bit right there. That's where I wanna try and dig my forearm into to lever. You can see I'm not really on the blade. If it's more hidden and I'm on the blade, well, you're on the blade. Okay, we've gotta disarm this. So, by pulling the butt of the knife in and pressing this down, I can get that motion there. And one thing that'll make that a hundred times more effective is if I take a big step out to the side. It gives me a lot more leverage there. So it's a very effective uh, disarm here because I can sidestep, circle around, and get a lot more leverage on it. Okay. So uh, one of the most effective knife stabs on Alio's defenses, but I don't know how often you're, you're going to run into this um, in the event that you actually find yourself in knife defense situation. So uh, hopefully you never find yourself in a knife defense situation. And if you do, I think the possibility of someone stabbing you like this is extremely low. So two extremely low situations stack. Okay. So <clears throat> he's maybe got a hold of me, or even if he doesn't, for whatever reason, he's kind of hiding the knife and stabbing it. So hands should be up. Boom. Five finger grips on top. Hand feeds under. I start to turn this wrist, sidestep for the disarm. Okay. From a different angle here. You see how much you can see from this strange angle. Boom. Grabbing, sidestepping. You can see I just continue to pull back, twist that knife out of my hands. Sidestep really gives me a ton of leverage on that disarm. 